Crusher saying that they're a bunch of punks and they like to roll in a pack, that they out here calling people out like they like they're gonna be the one on one champ and uh, they don't even get out the car. Crusher, hey Mikey, who's doing nine pounds, Mikey? Roger D on walkie talkie doing the nine, I copy you. Mike, you forgot to tell him with that good audio is coming a real manhood behind it. I said you forgot to tell him with that good audio is real manhood coming behind it. Yeah, yeah, don't worry about that. 72 or less, baby. I do. And and you know what? He likes to flaunt that fact. He likes to flaunt that fact and show the public just what I mean by that statement. And I control his dick. <laughs> love that story. You know, you know, it's probably that story that got me uh, an invitation to an FBI badge, but you know how that goes. You're running with boys, I'm running with men, I'm going to be squeezing until I'm 110, get down. Uh, CK, you ain't reaching my age. Salty as sweet, bitch. I'm Claire. because he's a king of sidestepping. CK, it's not what you don't do. It's what you shouldn't have tried to do that says you ain't going to see my age. Salty and sweet, B.I. Yo, go to 19 to control somebody's dick. Just remember, Spin Doctor, try to steer and throw it off. It's not what you don't do. It's what you shouldn't have tried to do is why you're not going to see my age. Salty or sweet. And you know what? Nine dumb dumb drops the camera. So when he's got to tell a story later on that night, he's going to go, man, I tell you, you should have seen it. He was just about to get him, and then all of a sudden, I don't know what the fuck happened, but I dropped my camera. Ain't that a bitch? Something must have scared the living shit out of the boy. Are you dreaming again? Are you dreaming again, man? You're going to try. 
CK, I'm going to run this line as truth and fact. When my daddy shows me tomorrow, I want to believe it's a nightmare. Glad you're right on. About time somebody wanted to take knuckleheads out of my radio. What up, Trey? Roger, right on. You should have seen it last night, them two videos, man. I guess the locals are getting real good at knowing how to take control of their airwave. More so when they say, you know what, there's nothing we can do. Richie's not a chump. Richie's not a punk. Richie's going to, yeah, Richie's going to blow, rock, rock with every blow. So what we got to do is cut his ears off and make sure he don't got to get into it. I thought that was sweet. It took me a little while to figure that out, but you know, hey, oh, hey. I guess that's the difference between a real man and the ones out there trying to entice a real man. The king got down. Well, some might view it as enticement. Me, I view it as enchantment. Yo, man, you find anything good that would open up, man, please come get me, because uh, <laughs> I got to do something other than play with these Mickey Mouse little puppeteers. Take care, take care, take care. I'm back, y'all. Bye, bye, bye. Roger D., the king of New York, side stepping. Ninja, where you at, Ninja? Walkie talkie. Right, where you going, walkie talkie, want to know? It's the polio, I'm telling you. It's the polio cream style curd that makes the best homemade float in the water mozzarella. Take it out of there and marinate it with a little oil, vinegar, and red pepper and brazinga, oh man. Looking good. So I can't believe it. The man didn't even get out the car. Talk like he the motherfucking uh, uh 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 like like he the trigger, and dump plugger didn't even get out the ride. Yo, it's worse than Tom and Jerry. It's the Jerry Springer audience that got all perturbed and want to get in the mix. That's good, people. I wasn't there. A347. A347. Yeah, I'm going to get him. Yeah, I'm going to get him. Yeah, I'm going to get him. You're welcome to engage him and uh, question him or, you know, try to, like, uh, communicate with him. But, uh, you know, he ain't operating a radio. He operating a skeet shooter and want to know how Richie can always get a duck plug and a backfire. I don't want to engage with anybody. I'm just saying that the Tom and Jerry games, you should take it to another channel, man, because there's people out here that want to talk, and all they hear is the crap that's going back and forth for the voice changing and the bullshit and the crackhead and the, and the your father this, your mother that, you know. It's getting sick of me already. You guys should fucking uh, get a room and make out and butt fuck each other. Well, they do. That's why they're known as the uh, uh, the backpack. You're talking about cupcake with the voice changer, bad girl uh, five one five with the nasal condition and the <laughs> and nine one nine one one nine one one Mister Enforcer two five zero and uh, and uh, 
the, the new cat, the new cat from the crew that decided he wanted to move into the heart of it all and said, geez, I got no more radio. Uh, you know, I either got to act right or I just ain't got a radio. I, I got a squawk box. I got a one-way, a, a, <laughs> I got a one-way mic. This is what sometimes makes me want to sell my shit. I'm just going to take seven. Well, you know, you know, 347, I really, um, I really would like to sympathize with that, but this is the type of shit that keeps me wanting to turn it on and key the mic, Tevo. Have a decent conversation. Can you have an intellectual conversation? Yes, we sure can. As a matter of fact, I think somebody's trying to shout at you, 347. I think Ninja's trying to get in your radio to show you just how us Brooklynites can have a real decent conversation. Yeah, Chaco, let's call him. Fucking decent conversation. This is fucking Rockland on 347. You didn't figure that out? I couldn't do that all morning, all right? He's going through a little crisis right now, but you want to back that up. Yeah, I'm going to say some shit that has to jump out the window right now. You know what the funny part is, Richie? I bet you I'd be able to understand him if he got rid of all of that bass and echo shit. What's going on, Angle? You know, if he got rid of that shit, then I'd understand him. I'd be able to hear him, I should say. I can hear him. Well, I must have stepped away real quick. Uh, well, you know what it is, Ninja? He, he, he's not about trying to sound good out here. He doesn't realize that, you know, nobody hears him, number one. And when we could hear him, it is hard to make him out because of all that bullshit. But he's just entertaining himself. He doesn't realize that as good as he can make it sound and as he hits through his headphones and his listening devices, that's not what it's sounding like over the air because RF is a different kind of uh, mode monster. I guess he just doesn't understand that in order for it to sound like that in his ear on the air, it's got to be less than 97, but he'll never figure that out. Ah, uh, 347 taking me out, shame on it. Don't let him get used to it. I ain't gonna let him get used to it. 72 or less, come out. I waited out. 410, 347 on the side, reading the mail. Roger D. That's the only thing I got out of that big old fucking mess. Roger. That's cause I spun the knob all the way to the right before. Listen, I'm not so sure they're drinking water. Drink what you piss. You see that? Look at their look at their homo desires. You see that? There's no fucking desires. You drink piss. You piss in your own fucking you drink it. But you, you keep fucking um trying to like say, did you hear that? Did you see that? Did you hear that? Well guess what? I'm gonna try this one more time. No, I don't know what the fuck he's saying. Ten four. The only time I know what he's saying is when you repeat it. Bajo. Roger D's on me having the roll of five. Well, I guess then we got to praise Richie's video gates because they are getting mighty hilarious again and the views are starting to climb all over again. Jeez, it was supposed to climb after the Ameritron and I rocked out the skip. You know what y'all got to start doing when you get to hear him running that those partial sentences say, Where's the rest of the video gate? Let us hear the full gate. And that's it. He, he gets all, all frantic. Yeah, 
That's like saying, yeah, 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 but I'm, uh, yeah, imagine that. You know what it is? He, he don't understand. He's like, uh, he's happy if he can get a partial and, you know, wow, you know what this could look like right here? You know, to him, to him, that's a, that's a star bite, you know? I guess you're right. Wash woman. Somebody's squealing real bad. Are you trying to find the CB shop? Click the mic twice if you're looking for me, dude. Are you on the corner, 46 and Winthrop? Give me two clicks if you're at 46 and Winthrop. Okay, I'll be out in a couple of minutes. Stay on Winthrop. Call, call this number, 347-741. Seven, oh no, damn, I got that shut off. All right, all right. Yeah, no, three, four, let me kill this video gate. Uh, three, four, seven, seven, four, one, seven, six, oh, seven. Dial that number, three, four, seven, seven, four, one, seven, six, zero, seven for your Brooklyn CB shop. Well, people got his number.